Peter Knoll, and this is my six-year-old Bernese Mountain Dog, Nani. Nani is one of the few that are natural surfers. Uh, the first time she just uh, stepped up on the board in the, in the water, and I pushed her out, turned her around, and the first wave she sat down in and said, wow, that's pretty cool. We try it again. The next wave she stood up, and that's, that's her history. Since then, we've been entering different dog surfing contests that benefit various charities and having a ton of fun. I'm Scott Chandler. We're from Carlsbad, California. This is Zoe the Surf Dog, my daughter Tyler, my daughter Kai, and we're the surf tandem we call it. Not tandem, but tandem. There's three of us and the dog on the surfboard. So uh, the conditions today look like it's going to be a little bit of extreme dog surfing since we have a high surf advisory. So uh, things are going to be a little difficult, but we're going to give it a go. How did your dog start? Uh, I surf professionally for a living and uh, always wanted a dog that could surf. So I, we uh, managed to get Zoe and then I started taking her on a bigger board in flat water and got her comfortable being on the board, built, built up some trust and uh, started taking her in the surf and she really uh, enjoyed it. Kind of made it a, uh, a fun thing for her. I would take a ball out and throw it to her while we were out waiting for sets and stuff. So uh, ideally just, just to make the, the comfort level and, the, and build the trust between the, the, the pet owner and the pet and, and get her comfortable with the ocean. Well, I'm Kathleen Cochran and I'm general manager of the Lowe's Coronado Bay Resort and we are here at uh, Imperial Beach for our fifth annual surf dog competition. Gosh, I don't know, I think we spe expect about 2,500 people today. We've got 65 dogs, which is the largest gathering of four-legged friends that we've ever had. And uh, we hope, gosh, we hope to raise a lot of money for a really good cause. Um, the fundraiser today is going to uh, some unsung heroes, our four-legged friends at the San Diego Police Canine Association, and so I think they're a really deserving cause. Anybody can surf. It's, it helps if your dog likes water, and you do. It's very important that your dog can swim, and you can swim. Uh, other than that, that's all it takes. 